Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Uh, so it's just going to be a really quick video today. Uh, so today I'm going to show you how to cut and replace a sheet of glass in your greenhouse. Um, obviously if you've already got your glass cut, um, it will still apply because I'll show you how to fit the clips and stuff as well. Uh, but I thought I'd show you how to cut it because I've got two little, I've got some new glass and I've got some big sheets. But they don't quite reach all the way up, you can see there's a big gap at the top there. So uh, I've got another sheet which I'm going to cut two little strips out to fit along there. And I've got a box of clips uh, which I got from the shop and a little glass cutter. Uh, so I thought I'd show you anyway, so hopefully you'll find this video useful. Uh, so I'll get back to you in a sec and we'll make a start. Okay, so um, these are the clips. I just bought these. Uh, you can find them in most garden centres. Uh, so I've got these little Z clips or whatever they're called, uh, which hold the glass, stop it from sliding down and the normal clips which hold the glass in. So I'll show you how they all work in a minute. And also, uh, I do need to cut the glass. So um, this was about three pounds uh, from my local hardware shop. Uh, it's just real simple, just run it along the glass, bend it and it will snap it. So. Okay, so hopefully you can hear me and see me. So these are the two pieces of glass which I want to cut. So I thought I'd make it as simple as possible. I'm not even gonna use tape measure. Uh, I've just got a bit of bamboo and a mark pin. And I'm gonna mark, not quite all the way to the top, but almost all the way to the top of where the glass would go. And then just down to where the other glass ends. So the highest point is as well. Do that again from the other side. Yeah, about all there. Yeah, my glass is already the right width, so all I need to do is cut a piece of that along. And luckily the other one will be the same. So two pieces of glass that length I'm gonna cut, then I'll show you how to attach them. Okay, so this is the piece of glass I've got. It's the right width already, so uh, I've got a nice straight edge along there. This bit is a bit wonky, uh, but it doesn't matter too much if it's a little bit wonky. So what I'm going to do is mark where to cut along here. I'll bring you over in a minute and give you a close up of what I'm doing. So I'm just going to put three little marks along there. I'll bring you over. Okay, uh, so I don't know if you can see them, but I've got three dots here. And uh, I'm just going to use a straight edge, you can use anything. Uh, the glass doesn't have to be exactly straight. It won't make much difference. So as long as it's more or less, that's fine. So we'll do a straight line across there. And then you've got your glass cutter here. So this little bit at the top, you need to press down onto the glass. So I'm gonna try and do that freehand, more or less, just following the line. Like I said, it doesn't have to be exact. You've got a bit of leeway. There's about an inch or so at the top, which you can hide. So as long as it's more or less, it's fine. And you just press it quite hard and run it along the line. over twice if you miss a bit like I did. So now all we've got to do is try and break this. If you just apply some pressure on it, it should snap quite easily. Like so. So that's one bit cut. So I'll do the other bit. 
Now I can actually just use this bit to mark the right size for the next piece. And I don't even need to draw a line, I could just go along there, but I will draw the line. Like I said, it's not going to be perfect, but it doesn't matter because the wonky bit you can hide along the top. So as long as you've got one straightish line, it's fine. Okay, so I'll get the next bit cut and I'll show you how to fit them. Okay, so I've got the both bits of glass cut and I'm going to need two of each of these clips. And I'll just do one piece, I'll show you the first piece. So we'll take this outside and I'll show you how to fit it. Okay, so got my glass and got my clips. So the first thing I'm gonna do is hook these little clips onto this piece of glass. So you need at least two of them. Yeah, sometimes they're a bit small, but they should be fine. So then you're gonna hook the next piece of glass onto them. like that and then I'll try and zoom you in a bit to get this clip fitted so I can get it out of my pocket <laughs> don't let go of this because it will fall forward so with these they can sometimes be a bit fiddly there you go. Hook the two bits under here and then spread it apart. And you have to push it in. This says. Uh, you'll get the hang of it once you've done it a couple of times. They can be fiddly. And it probably is an easier way to do this. There's one on. Yeah, it should be fine with one now. I'll do the other side. I'll zoom you over there. Like I said, there's probably a knack to it. But you just line it up there. Spread it apart, push it in. And it should clip in nicely. So there we go. That's one piece fitted. So um, if you want, I'll show you the other one as well. Just to double up make sure you've got the hang of it so I'll go get the other piece of glass okay so I do apologize if it's if it's a bit of wind noise on this video or if you've got all the ducks cracking away in the background uh, they're currently on lockdown the ducks so uh, for this avian flu uh, anyway hopefully the sound will be all right um, anyway so we'll get the next piece fitted um, sometimes with these clips if they're a bit narrow, like these ones are, you just spread them apart just a little bit. Yeah, because this glass is slightly thick. Yeah, that's all you need to do if they're a bit small. And then hook them on there. And, like I said, you can see this cut's not perfect by any means, but it'll be hidden up here in the lip anyway so it doesn't matter at all okay, so I'm going to push these clips further along because we've got a bit of a wonky bit there and it's fine even if there's a gap at the top a little one We'll add ventilation. Okay, so again, I'll show you the clips. Uh, I'll move you in closer. That's actually staying there now, but be careful it doesn't fall out. Okay, so I'll show you this again. Uh, these two bits hook under there, as far forward as you can get them and then spread it apart and push it in like that 
Uh, sometimes it can be a bit fiddly, especially with the new clips like these. Uh, they're quite strong and hard to bend. And I'll show you the other side. Uh, I just want to make sure that you're getting how I'm doing it. So this way. I'm going to place it there. And then what I normally do is use one of my fingers to bend it down a bit. And then just press it in. Make sure both bits clip under. And that's all we're to do. And that glass isn't going anywhere. Okay, so that's both of our pieces of glass fitted. Uh, you can see there's no gaps on the inside, so it doesn't have to be exact. And it doesn't matter if your line's not quite straight, like you can see there. Makes no difference, there's still no gaps. So, that's all there is to it. Okay, everyone. Uh, so I hope you found that video useful. I tried to explain as best as I could how to fit your glass and cut them. Um, if you're after the little glass cutter, you can find them in most hardware stores. Um, I don't know, anywhere really. Just, you can type into Google glass cutter and you'll find them. They're very cheap and they're really good. It's got about six different things. So once one of them's worn out, uh, you can spin it around. Um, it's got different sizes as well. Um, doesn't seem to make much difference to be honest. Uh, but anyway, so uh, if you're after your clips as well, they're in the garden centers or you can order them from online. They're quite cheap as well. Um, so I think that's about it for today, guys. I don't think there's anything else I need to explain or tell you. So it's just a real quick one just to show you how to fit your glass in your greenhouse. Uh, the main reason for this video was uh, I did a video on assembling the greenhouse and I missed out the actual fitting of the glass because uh, I thought it was quite straightforward, but it actually is quite fiddly. Uh, so anyway, once you've got the hang of it, once you've done one piece, it's easy once you've got the hang. It's just getting them clips in. Uh, they can, you can get slightly different clips as well, uh, but they're all pretty straightforward once you've got the first one in. Um, anyway, so thank you very much for watching. Hope you found this useful. Uh, if you did, please subscribe, that'd be great. And any questions, leave a comment below. And don't forget to like and share the video. See you on the next one.